Well, if you have a vehicle that's somewhere about 06 or 07 and up, you probably have TPMS, which is Tire Pressure Monitoring System. And if you haven't seen it, here's the little guy. There's a sensor inside your wheel and it's monitoring tire pressure. And a lot of these are smart now. They know it's right front, it's left front, it's right rear, it's left rear. Problem is, let's say you rotate your tires, um, now it's thrown off and the computer's gonna throw a warning sign because it doesn't understand why the sensor has moved from right front to left rear. So OTC has come up with a cool tool that uh, actually can go in and program a sensor. And this is an easy sensor, so it's basically like a universal sensor that will work depending on who you ask. 70 to 90% of vehicles, you're gonna be able to program this sensor and instead of going into the vehicle and working on the vehicle's computer, you can physically do it on the sensor itself. Let's say you have a customer that comes up, he's got a bad sensor. All you do is walk up, push select, go through the different vehicles, no matter whether it's American, European, Asian, most all of them are gonna be in here. Pick the model and you can see whether the sensor works or not. Go to each one and that way you can tell the guy, hey man, your right front is not working. Um, the other thing that's cool about it is, like we said, with the easy sensor, you're able to download the original sensor information, bring it into here, plop in, transfer that into the easy sensor, replace the wheel, and now you're back on the road and it's a lot easier, cheaper way to do it than some of the other models that are out there. Now, if you have one of the OTC Genesis scan tools, which is their upper end scan tool, uh, they also have the dongle. Yes, that is a technical term. And what it, the dongle does, it goes between your TPR and your scan tool and the, the car's computer. So it allows the three of them to communicate together. And the reason you want to do that is let's say that uh, you did have to do a regen on the car's computer. This would allow all the pieces to talk to each other and it would allow you to do that a lot faster.